<laughs> All right. <laughs> the game is over. That took four hours, less than four hours. Uh, Cause uh, I spent like the first 15 minutes. Uh, this game was estimated at nine hours. Uh, huh. <laughs> Yeah, it wasn't the best birthday present. <laughs> wow. Um, well, obviously I have nothing written down because I thought this would take at least two days. Um, I've got to say the story is by far one of the, uh, the most rushed stories I have ever had the, the pleasure of experiencing in my entire life. <laughs> They were just going full speed ahead. They didn't care about details. They didn't care about uh, fleshing out things. They didn't care about introducing people. They were just like, you know who this is? You recognize this character? Uh, pium. <laughs> we're going. <laughs> uh, you got it, played it for a few hours, and it was over. If you learned anything from Trails, this game didn't have enough text. I... I definitely got to agree with that one. Um, there was like absolutely nothing that I could say about the story that that could possibly give this any bit of justice in regards to just I don't, I don't even know what to say really. I, I don't know anything about Dragon Ball. And after playing this game, I still know nothing about Dragon Ball. <laughs> you can, if you collect Dragon Balls, doesn't even tell you how many Dragon Balls there are, by the way. But if you collect Dragon Balls, uh, you can wish, uh, presumably anything, almost anything, and and there you go. Now uh, you you, uh, you got the basic plot from this game. I got that uh, Gohan was kidnapped by Vegeta. We defeat Vegeta a couple of times, and then they turn into monkeys, and then uh, then they get stopped, and then uh, I don't remember. Oh, and then we fight the uh, the Super Saiyan squad. I forget what their actual name is, and then we beat them, and then we find Frieza, and then we beat Frieza, and and there we go. In like a thousand less episodes. It was very, very bare bones. Is, I, is, is the credits like looping? I don't know if the credits are looping, but we're just gonna, we're just gonna, we're just, we're just, we're just gonna assume they're not. Um, I, I think the gameplay as a whole, you know, all of this off the top of my head, some of it was, or, the majority of it was actually just kind of frustrating. Uh, not being able to see cooldowns on on your abilities and things like that is kind of frustrating. But you know, okay, you know, I, I can work around this. My biggest issue was the inconsistency of where you can hit enemies. It's you know, if you stand in one position, you can't hit the enemy at all, but they can hit you, and that's really frustrating. And on top of that, uh. The, the geometry for the, the objects just get in the way. And it's so obnoxious. I've, I've run into trees and rocks and sometimes it just doesn't look like I'm running into anything, but I just stop for no reason. Um, yeah, this is, this is totally loopy. Um, so that in of itself was, was pretty frustrating. Um, overall, I thought the game was okay, I guess, you know, um, it didn't really do anything to, to, it, it really, it, it honestly didn't really do a whole lot of anything. Um, I, I wasn't disgusted by the game, but it wasn't the greatest game that I've ever played. It was, it's, it's one of the shortest games I've ever played. <laughs> I'll give them, I'll give it that. Um, but yeah, I guess, I guess that's, uh, what, what is it, uh? Dragon Ball Z, The Legacy of Goku by Infogrames. Is it really Infogrames? Not Infogames? Um, but uh, yeah, I 
again, I was expecting this to take about nine hours or so, so I guess that's going to wrap it up for me for today. Um, yeah, uh, I don't know what I'm going to be playing, but I'll figure something out. So thanks for watching. Appreciate it. See you tomorrow, 8.30 a.m. Well, actually, maybe not tomorrow, Well, but maybe tomorrow. If, if I'm not back tomorrow, I'll be back on Monday, 8.30 a.m. Pacific. 